Most fungi disperse their offspring by releasing spores. Most fungal spores and the nuclei of most growing fungal mycelia are haploid. When a fungus is growing rapidly and food is plentiful, it's more likely to reproduce asexually. The fungus produces fruiting structures that release spores genetically identical to the parent. The spores may be transported great distances by the wind. Sexual reproduction can occur when individual organisms of different mating types encounter each other. Mating type is a genetic characteristic analogous to the distinction of male and female in plants and animals. But a fungal species may have more than two mating types, and individuals of different mating types usually have no obvious morphological differences. Since hyphae of the same mating type cannot mate, self-fertilization is prevented. In sexual reproduction, the hyphae of the mating fungi join and their cytoplasms fuse. A distinctive characteristic of fungi is that in many cases, the two haploid nuclei do not join immediately. Instead, the fungal hyphae may exist in a dikaryotic stage. The word dikaryotic has roots meaning two nuclei. The pairs of nuclei may coexist for a long time after the mating, before the haploid nuclei eventually fuse. The diploid stage, which may be brief, is followed by a meiosis step that leads to the formation of genetically 